Okay, so this is your trail walk. So it's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So it's it's slow. It's not a fast walk, but this is what you'd be doing if you were riding with somebody who's slower. Okay. So you want to make sure that the horse can walk this slow, because okay. otherwise if they're gating all the time, nobody else can ride with you. Okay. So it's just one, two, three, four. And his legs are all moving independently, so it's four beats. Okay, yeah. so now it's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. He's slowing down a little bit, so the hardest part is keeping that same rhythm. Okay. Yep. Good. So now as you're going at the flat walk, you'll feel yourself shifting back and forth in the saddle. Yeah. Yep. And that's what you're supposed to be doing, so that's how you know you're doing the flat walk. Okay. Now with him, he's going to keep trying to slow down. So yep. as he tries to slow down, try not to kick him because everybody's in the habit of kicking him. Use your spur okay. I, or your stick, yep. sorry. So one, two, three, four. He already slowed down a little bit. Yep. So this is going to be your running walk. I'm just saying it so you can hear it on the video. Yeah. Yep. So keep driving them forward and bend your elbow a little bit more. You kind of keep pushing your arm forward because you're trying to be nice, okay. but then he's not going to be as collected. So you're going to have to drive him with your leg up into your hand and then kind of hold him. Okay. Keep that nose down. Anytime you see him looking for someone else to ride him, you got to bring that nose back in. Yep. Now lean back a little bit. You got it. Good. So the head's shaking, you're moving back and forth in the saddle. Okay. And you can glance at his head, just don't stare at it. I know it's hard because people are trying to see if it's shaking. But look at it and then look where you're okay. going. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So it's a forward walk, but it's not super fast. Yeah. Pretty. So now he's at that hard trot. So slow him down, lean back, lean back. That's it. Good. And then just try it again. Keep leaning back because again, if you tilt forward, he's going to go more towards the trot. Slow down a little bit because otherwise he's going to come out of it. That's better. A little bit more. Now he lost it. So lean back because you're tilting forward. There you go. That's it. So feel kind of that different sensation in the yeah. saddle. Now you're bouncing, yeah. so you know yeah. I'm hot. he's hard trotting. So just start over again. But see, he's not staying in it like he did his flat walk and his running walk because right. he's not used to doing it. So lean back as you do it. And you got to keep that rein. There you go. Stay that speed. No faster. So as it gets bouncier, you know you're going more towards the trot. So you got to try to keep him slow. And you can use the half halt or you can pull. Yeah. And now as he fox trots, you know, it's okay if his head is up a little bit because he falls out of it and keeping his head up will take him actually more towards the pace and help him to keep him in it. So he's still fox trotting. Just make sure he keeps it. Go one more time around. Lean back a little bit. Yep. So it should feel kind of like a jog and it's not very bouncy, but there is a little bit of movement to it. 